The mother's pregnant, killing herself, having this baby. And I come back home to find some peace and some comfort. My fiancé's a 12-hour no-show. I mean, I know he wasn't expecting me, but so what? Since when do engaged guys go out drinking and clubbing until all hours of the night without their intended brides? Oh. Hart, you better be dead, because if you're not, you have some serious explaining to do. Why don't you try calling her back? Why wouldn't she hang up on me, okay? I keep making her all these promises, and I keep disappointing her. Cassie, it's gonna be okay. I just can't stand to hear her cry. Hey, you're a good mother. I can see that. We are going to get your daughter back, I promise you. The only reason I stole the money is because I wanted to be with Tammy again, Hart. That is the only reason. I know. Now you have someone to help you. No, see, I, I don't think that's a great idea. Let me handle Dinah. It's not just Dinah. It's these people. You don't know how they are. I can handle these people. What if they find out you're helping me? What are they going to do? Are they going to break my legs? Is that what kind of people they are? If they were just gangsters, that would make it a heck of a lot easier. You know, Cassie, sooner or later, you're going to have to tell me who these people are. No, I am not telling you. Why not? What's the big thing? I mean, you've told me everything else. The big thing is these people are sick, Hart, okay? They're crazy. And they, they get you to do crazy things, like, like stealing money or... Or what? Well, they make a girl so angry that she goes and gets drunk off to kill at a bar, jumps up on a pool table, starts taking off her clothes, and passes out. They're not clean. Some really, really nice guy shows up and... Me. You see, it wasn't such a bad ending. Yeah, but here you are, riding up on your horse again. Actually, the horse threw a shoe. I took... I took the pickup. Another shattered dream. Wanda! Wanda, give me... Wanda! I need a little help in here, will you? Thanks. Listen, Annie, why don't you just lie down for a, for a minute? Just, uh, I huh? can't lie down. Come on, I have a million things that I have to do. Annie! Please, Alan, I'm okay. You are far from okay. You just spent the night in the hospital from an overdose of drugs and alcohol. Now, you almost died. Well, whose fault would that have been? We are equal partners, Alan. That was our agreement. Remember that? I'm not just going to sit back and do nothing. Look, I'm not asking you to do nothing, Annie. I'm just suggesting that you should take it easy. I'm not take it easy. I have plans. I have plans for Josh and Reva and for myself. Yes, I know In you fact, have plans. In fact, I want to talk about my shares. Your shares? What do you mean, stock? What? The Lewis shares that you're supposedly transferring to my name, well, remember? Well, some of them have already been transferred. But not all of them. Not all of them. That was our agreement. When is that going to be done, anyway? Soon. When? Look, it takes the paperwork just a few days to get through the process. But it is going to happen, yes, right? Because it, that is the deal. That is the deal, and it is going to happen. I'll tell you something else that's going to happen. I'm going to call Lewis Oil right now, check on our mole, Cassie. It's already on my list. Ah, I see it is. Now that we are equal partners in our relationship, we are going to work so well together. In fact, I think it's a good idea that I make that call to Cassie. What are we going to do? All right, all right. You what take care of the do? safe. I'll take care of Bill. Okay. Yes, I'll find him. Billy Lewis! Just Hart. The man I was looking for. Well, I'm glad to see I'm not the only one who gets up early I in the morning. I forgot those contracts, so I figured I'd come in. Well, luckily, she was here. Yep. I was here all night long. I had so much work to do, I just crashed on your couch. Well, that's good. Uh, you must have coffee. You want to have another cup? Uh, no, no. Actually, i got to take off. I'll see you another time. All right, talk to you soon. Oh, uh, wait. Uh, here, here are those contracts that you were... Thank you. Listen to me. Listen to me. You talk to these people. You tell them you slept with Bill. You tell them whatever you have to tell them. Okay? I'll call you soon. Lewis Oil. Cassie. Hello, it's Annie. I understand while I was away, you had another day with Mr. Billy Lewis. 
Yes, I did. So, sweetheart, how'd you make out? Oh, I'm being silly. We want to do a lot more than make out. Well, I only hope that for your sake, Cassie, Billy's as good in bed as his brother Josh was. Hello, Cassie. You haven't answered my question. Did you sleep with Billy or not? Phyllis thought she'd buried her past. I better cover my tracks. But this week... We need evidence. They're digging it up. They're on to Daniel's real father. Oh, girl, you better pray. Those people are trying to ruin my life. They don't hit pay dirt. You have no idea what's in store for you. On the young and the restless. Oh, I missed you so much. I missed you, too. When I rolled out of bed, there was no one there to catch me. I feel like I've been gone for days. Yeah, what took you so long? I told you I was going to wait up. It just, you know, things at Cross Creek took longer than I thought they were going to take. That, that's all. Where are the kids? Did they get off to school okay? Hey, did Wanda call? Joshua, she, knock uh, it off. What? You're trying to pull something on me here. No. And my baloney meter is in high fat content. You had a tone in your voice last night, and I'm noticing that same tone right now. What's going on? Uh, Annie came uh, busting into my life again last night to full throttle. Yes, I did. The check went out yesterday. Ah, let me guess. One of the Lewis boys is there, and you can't talk. That's correct, but thank you for calling. Oh, believe me, Cassie, it was all my pleasure. Oh, and before you hang up, just remember, I'm just a phone call away. And so is your little girl. Trouble? No, nothing I can't handle. You sure? Yeah, I'm positive. She did it. The eagle has landed in Billy Lewis's arms. She came through for us, Ellen. Good. Now for the pièce de résistance. What do you think that Josh should lose first, huh? Should it be his career or his marriage? <laughs> I'll tell you what I think. I think it's wonderful to see you so optimistic. Optimistic? Huh? I'm not just optimistic. I haven't felt this powerful or alive in my life. <laughs> you know, Annie, you seem a little, well, manic. I'm manic? Manic. Well, like manic depressive? Why don't you have me committed, no, 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 Alan? No, 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 that's not what well, I Well, then what do no, you mean, not... sweetheart? Because I really have a lot to do. No, I'll tell you, I'll tell you what I want. I, I want you no, to put no, this pen and paper down. And I want us, I want us to talk because I'm a little concerned about us. Annie, I love you. I've proven that to you. I've given you the power and stock and the CEO of the Equality. 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 We are partners, right? But to tell you the truth, I'm not for sure you feel the same way. Oh, really? You feel that way? Yes. Well, you should have thought about that before you paid our friend to testify against me in court. That's all that you remember that I said I love you? One clear picture in my mind, because it's the only one in my mind. Oh, Buzz. Why do you keep saying that, Buzz? Because that is your name. Oh, my goodness. That's a stupid name. That's a kid's name. Let's right, talk I'm about... I want to talk about out. here. I want to talk about where we are. Don't go, okay? I'll, I'll be right back. No, don't. Don't. I, no. Don't, please. I need you to stay right, here okay. just so I can right, piece right. this thing together, okay? Now, tell me where I am. You're in a cabin outside Springfield. Springfield. That's the town that you live in. Oh. Is it near here? It, it's not far. Do you recognize the name? <laughs> I don't even recognize my own hands. Well, you know what? They're strong hands. And, and they're very, they're very hard-working hands. And they're very gentle hands. Tell me what we mean to each other. We're friends. 
What about the love part? Well, love can mean a lot of different things. What does it mean to us? Don't hide. Are we important to each other? Did you mean it when you said you loved me? I told you. He Holly, I've heard your spiel about missing people, but you know your father. He would never be gone this long without calling us repeatedly. Not true. Uh, Jenna, I really... I, I, I think what I need is to have a little time alone. Hmm? Actually, I'd, I'd like to talk to you for just a second. We'll, okay. we'll be right outside if you need anything, okay? Great. Big time. What about you? Why didn't you call me? I would have called. I, I... When? When, when I had came walking through the door? When I had have some you time. Have you forgotten? I can pull some strings around here. The Spaldings have just a little bit of clout in this town. I know, but have you forgotten? I know I you was, were a cop, I was a cop, and Frank is thing, a cop, Harley. so the Coopers have a little bit of clout in that way. The, does that mean that you don't need all the help that you can get? No. Okay. No, of course not. I mean, it's not that. But she's scared to death in there. Of course she is, and so are you, and you have every right to be. And it's okay to let that out. I can't. I can't. Not not with her. Not right now. Why? You don't understand the situation. Why, is, why is her situation any different than yours? It's your Because father. she's pregnant. My father doesn't even know about this yet. So she's in there, and she's beating herself up because she didn't tell him. And now she thinks she may never have the chance to. Mm -hmm. He has been gone all night, Philip. Who is to say she isn't right? Oh, wait a minute. Don't start thinking like that. I can't help it. Yes, you can. You I don't know what to say to her. Right. You should have heard the things I was coming up with, these fake stats about missing people coming back, anything to try to make her feel better. And who's to say that you're not right? Who's to say that Buzz isn't going to come walking through the door any second? He won't. You don't know that. He won't. He won't. I feel it. Harley, you don't know that. I feel it. Something is wrong. Something is really wrong. I know it. You, you just don't. You don't. I can't lose him again. I can't. You're not going to lose him. Listen to me. We will find him. I don't care what it takes. We will find him and we'll bring him home, okay? Okay? Come here. Okay? You just ran against me, Ellen. Annie, let's not start this all again. You hurt Please. me. You hurt me very deeply. I thought we went through all of this at Cross Creek. Yes, you made your apologies. Yes, I, I did more than make an apology to you. I gave you the, the corporation, the stocks. Well, you I can mean... buy me things, but you can't buy my trust. I realize, Annie, it's going to take time, uh, and I will give you all the time that you need. It's going to take more than just time. There isn't enough time. Don't you understand? You can't put a Band-Aid on this and expect it to go away. I know that, No, Annie, it's I'm... not going to go away. I'm not like Josh and Reva. Josh and Reva can go around thinking that everything is okay because they say so. Well, Alan, I found out that's not how the world works. Yes, because Josh and Reva are fools. And I was a fool, too. Because I used to believe anything that I could shake a stick at. Right? I believed Josh. I believed you. Annie, you will be able to believe in me and trust me once again. I promise you. It's not going to be the same. It's not going to be the same. See, I lost a big part of me last night at Cross Creek. A part of me that sacrificed for Josh and the kids. I lost that. The part of me that still tried to believe in people. And the part of me that believed in you. If my betrayal caused you in any way no, to okay. think that No, it's okay. It's okay. It's really okay because I'm not going to have this illusion anymore. See, I have finally found out that I am not going to be happy unless I put me first, my needs first. And starting today, from now on, I'm first. First. I am finally going to get everything that I want. 
She's certifiable. I mean, she tried to kill herself at Cross Creek? She claimed it was an accident. But still, it... You saved her. Well, I didn't think I had a whole lot of choice, you know. I, I didn't want people finding her dead uh, uh, on the floor at our place there. Wait, 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 wait. What, what is it? I mean, something else is going on. You're not telling me yeah, something. The, the reason that uh, things took so long at Cross Creek is that I was putting the place back together. What'd she do? Take a hammer to the wine closet? No. No, she took a hatchet to the mantel. She, uh, hacked our initials out. And she tore up the wedding pillow and uh, threw our wedding photos all over the place and poured liquor all over them and broke the window and smashed a few more things up. You know, uh, I, di I didn't think that I could really dislike anybody this much. Even at her worst, I still felt sorry for her in some ways. But after I saw that place, I felt like she took a knife and put it into my chest. You know what? We don't have to think about this anymore. We can build another fireplace Leave mantle. It. I'll sew more pillows. She is out of our she's lives, out of Josh. our lives. She's trying to take over Lewis Oil, and she's kept you from finding your sister. Yeah, but you know what? She can do all that. She can do all that and more, because she doesn't have the one thing she really wants. Not anymore. What is this? Something that's going to make you feel much, much better. Is this what I think it is? Written in permanent ink. It's tiny, it's incredible. Can you believe it? I'm divorced. Yeah. We're free. We're finally free. <laughs> Continue with part two of Guiding Light in a moment. Well, 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 well. Look what the cat dragged in. Hey, there, baby. What are you... Don't uh... baby me. Start explaining, Hart. Where were you all night? Unless, of course, you think that it's unreasonable for your fiancé to ask you where you were most of the night and most of the morning, huh? Do you think that's an unreasonable a perfectly request? perfectly logical explanation. explanation. Just forget the clichés. I'm really mad. I came here last night to, to talk to you. I was upset, and you're nowhere to be found. Now, what's going on? I can see why you're upset. I'm sorry. What, what happened? No, no, no. I'm not telling you anything until you start talking. So, um, hi. If you love me, that means we have, like, what? A relationship? We're friends. Um, good friends. Good friends. So, we mean something to each other. I, I'd like to think so. <sighs> Why don't you just tell me that in the first place? <sighs> Buzz. Yeah? Buzz, no, listen to me. Wake up. Please. Buzz, please. please. No, no, you please. can't go to I'm sleep. So I'm just going to have to keep so... talking. I'm just going to have to keep talking. Do you know that you are Greek? Do you know that? I'm Greek? You are. Of course you... Yes, of course you don't know that. But somewhere inside of you, you know that. You know that, and you're going to know everything else. I, I, it's just going to take some time. <laughs> Nola, do you always go on like this? Sometimes. My mouth just tends to move at its own pace. It's okay. I like listening to you. Okay. I'm gonna get that aspirin. No, tell me. Talk to me. Tell me about what we mean to each other. Maybe another time. That's all I got is time, lady. That's all I got is big spaces of time. I want to know what was important to us. What's, what's our hopes, our dreams, you know? I need to know so I can... Please? I have a lot of hopes. I have a lot of dreams. More than you know. Can you see little multicolored spots with Here, your now eyes take closed? this. I want you to take me? this now, please. You know, lady, I don't know what is beyond that door. The one thing I do know, you're a very good lady. Very nice. Very you know nice. what? Pretty soon, you're going to remember everything. You're going to remember your family 
and your children and your life. Everything. Frank, have there been any new admittances to the hospital? Any of the hospitals? Well, that could be good news, couldn't it? Yeah. No, uh, I'm just uh, tired. Very tired. Uh, that's all you're hearing. Frank, I will feel so much better once we find Fuzz. All right? Please, would you call me if there's anything new? sitting here like I knew you would be by yourself scared to death no, I wasn't by myself I was with Ch Jenna you know we all put up walls and try to protect ourselves because when you care about somebody they have the ability to hurt you and that's a scary thing but the alternative is not caring not feeling. And that's a lot scarier. I don't want that. I mean, I don't want to be that kind of person. Do you know how much I want to make you feel better right now? Divorce never tasted this good. Come here. Come here. <laughs> can you believe it? I mean, can you believe it? I mean, we're finally, our lives are an antifreeze zone, officially, right here, right now. What do you want to mm. do first? First? Mm -hmm. Well. We could set a wedding date. No, 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 yeah. better yet. We should throw a divorce party, you know, and celebrate the fact that she's out of our lives for good. I have an idea. Why don't we never mention her name again? Makes you sick, too, huh? It just gives her too much power. No. No, Joshua. She has no power. She's done some terrible, horrible things, but she can't bother us. What we cherish and everything we have together is right here. It's in our hearts. And that's our love. That's what's between us. And it's a thousand times more powerful than anything she can do. Let's go back to that celebration <laughs> idea again. I like that idea. Okay. I'm about ready. Oh. I am I am at the point where I'm ready to spend the rest of my life with the most beautiful, wonderful, intelligent, the most special woman on the face of the earth. Special? Uh. Ooh, I like this special part. <laughs> <laughs> Annie. I have no problem whatsoever with you putting yourself first. Are you sure? Yes. Because I don't want to start anything that I'm not going to be happy finishing. I have done that in my life. Well, I think it's all right to be selfish. A lot of people would think that that's a character flaw. No, no, no. Because I know together we have incredible power. I know that when we get to the top of that mountain, we will be there together. Why? Because we're honest, because we're focused, <laughs> and because we have clarity of purpose. Mm. <laughs> so you do understand? Oh, yes. I have what you need, 
You have what I need. We're partners. Huh? You do have what In I need. In every sense of the word. You do have what I need. <laughs> oh. Um. <clears throat> what is it, Nettie? This came from Miss Dutton. Fine. I'll take it. I'll take it. Thank you. Huh. This is Nettie. I lost a couple of the If you can find it, I appreciate it. Yes, sir. I'll tell the staff. Well, what have you what have you got there? Nothing. I, it's not important. It just reminds me of who I am and what I have to do. So where were we? Hmm? <laughs> well, can I have a cup of coffee first? Absolutely. Right after you come clean. Uh, you, want, you want the truth? Yeah, mm -hmm. that would be nice. I prevented a robbery from happening. What? Yeah, a robbery. Are you kidding me? Oh, my God, Hart. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine now. Well, were you in danger? Do they have guns or no, something? No, I mean, it, it turned out to be pretty harmless, actually. Oh, baby. I'm sorry, are you sure you're okay? Oh, yeah, I'm fine. Well... So, what happened? Did they get away? Yeah, they did, actually. Did they get the money? No. No, I, I prevented that from happening. Wow. Yeah. It's crazy. So you were at the police station all night, then? Yeah, you know, I was, I was doing what I had to do. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. You no. know, you're all night at the police station, saving the day, oh, and I, I walk in here and day. jump all over you. It's That's not like I'm a hero or anything. Yes, you are a hero. I could do a profile of this whole thing on, on my show on WSPR. No. Yes. no, that's not a good idea. No, this would be good. Uh, it would yeah. be a good promotion. Don't be shy. You would like it. Tell me everything. I, I want to know, where, where did this happen? Weren't you going to Lewis Oil last night? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was on the way to Lewis Oil, yeah. and, uh, and uh, you know, it's just not such a big deal, you know? I mean, I'm a jerk for not calling you and leaving you a message. Well, you come worry on, forget that. Me. I mean, under the circumstances, it was pretty tough. It's okay. Well, what about you? I mean, you said you had a terrible night, too. What happened? Yeah, I did. And your eyes are bloodshot. I just didn't sleep very well, and I, I suppose I was crying a little bit. Crying? Why were you crying? Well, you know, I'm saying my mother looks great. She looks so great. Yeah, she looks that. fantastic. Right. It's because she's pregnant. What? It's not a good thing. If she goes through with this pregnancy, she could die. Wait a minute, wait, wait a minute, here. I know, and so... Well, I mean, she could die because if her disease comes out of remission, that's it. But her, she refuses to see that. She and Matt are so caught up with, you know, having this baby and being in love that they refuse to see how ridiculous they're being. Wow. I... Well, what about the doctors? I mean... Oh, they yeah, say? they talk to doctors, but they're not going to listen to reason. I mean, they really believe that they're in this, you know, miracles can happen to us life. I, I, I believe that they've lost... Uh, Lost a grip on reality. I'm sorry, sweetie. So I, this is why I wanted to talk to you so badly, because I don't think she should go through with it, and, uh... Am I crazy? I mean, do you think that's no. unreasonable? No, 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 not at all. I mean, you know, you could give this whole miracles thing a chance. Hart, the fact that she's alive is a miracle. I figure one to a customer, you know? I'm sorry. I'm really so sorry, baby. If I would have known, I would have called you. No, it's okay. I mean, now I, I understand what happened. It's, it's fine. But a few hours ago, you don't even want to know the thoughts that were going through my head. Cassie. Yeah. I, uh, I have some proofreading for you to do, okay? Great. Okay. You look a little, uh, you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. Fine. You seem a little jittery. I have noticed. <laughs> Maybe it's all that coffee you drank this morning. Yeah, it was pretty strong. Hey, Hart Jessup's a real nice guy, isn't he? Yeah, he is. You didn't bother you coming in too early this morning, did he? No. Okay. Oh! 
Look, there's a, a new uh, surf and turf restaurant in town. I thought maybe if you weren't doing anything the next couple nights, um, we might go. Well, I mean, if you don't have anything else to do. I'd love to go out with you. You would? Yes. Why? I mean, haven't you been having a good time? Oh, hey, I've been having time in my life. <laughs> yeah. Okay. okay, I'll make reservations. Great. Oh. I almost forgot. Oh, okay. Thanks. Oh, and uh, for the record, you know, uh, Hart Jessup has a fiance. I know. Daughter's not speaking to me. I'm leading this poor man on. Annie and Alan won't quit. Hart. Even with your help, this is not going to work. You know, Annie. You are perfect mm. in every way, and so beautiful. And smart. You have to admit that I'm getting smarter yes. and smarter every day. You know, you're very smart. The smartest thing you ever did was to come back here, because together, we can have it all, you know? I just saw him. Come on. Wait a minute. Are you, are you sure you want to do this? Of course I want to make love to you. Come on, Alan. Why are you asking that question? Something's wrong. Some, something's different, Annie. I don't know what it is. Alan, and, I'm kissing you. No, what no, do you want? No, 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 Annie. It's different. I told you already. I am different. Yes, well, yeah, but I don't want to play games, okay? I am not playing games. Mm -hmm. Are you saying that you don't want me? You know that's not what I'm saying. Like because I'm here for you. I'm dying to make love to you. I'm here, Alan. Annie, it... I will always be here for you. Mm. You know what's really amazing? is that I still tingle all over my body every time you kiss me. Mm, there really? it is. Yeah. Mm -hmm. mm, it's still as good as it's always been. It's better, isn't it? I guess that's our miracle, huh? No. My miracle is that every time you make love to me, I fall in love with you all over again. I think I'm getting that tingling feeling. <laughs> you are? I love you. Mm. This is insane. I mean, my father is missing. I just found out that his wife is pregnant and I'm making out with you in the hallway like a teenager. You're allowed to feel better for a minute. You're allowed that. Let's go in. Let's let's go in and see what Jen is up to. Sure. Jenna. All right, I I think this has gone on long enough. Why don't we leave? Why don't we go to the police station and talk to Frank? I just spoke to him. There's nothing new. Okay, um, why don't I take you home? Don't you want to see Coop? I don't want him to see me like this, and he'll, he'll know something's dreadfully wrong. No, no, he's, he's, he's very happy with Elaney, and besides, Buzz left a message here. You know, maybe he'll call back again. Okay. You know what? I, I can't stay here. Um, we're gonna go down to the police station, okay? Oh. And, um... And we'll call you from there and let you know if something's happened. Yeah, and why don't you try to get some rest? No, I That's a great I idea, Jenna. Rest. You need to rest. Okay? You didn't sleep at all last night. You need to rest. So just lie down and everything's going to be fine. Just take a little nap. We will call you okay. if anything happens. Okay? Okay.
sorry to disappoint you, Gemma. Jeffrey, what are you doing here? What do you think? Don't come any closer to me. Baby, Jenna. Don't stay away you from me. You miss me? No. You know, I'm back. I'm no. back. You can't get rid of me. Go away. Go away. Go away. Go away. Go away. You come over right away, please. I have to tell you something. Here you go. Thank you. tell you about this woman that's in your life. No, okay, maybe tomorrow, or maybe the next day. No, but you, you, you really I, need... No, I really, I can't. No, I can't. no, you have to understand. No, no, about... you, you have to understand. I just walked out of one life, and now I'm into another, and the only person I'm connected with is you. But, Buzz... So I really can't do this right now. You have to... I've been through a lot. You don't understand this. I mean, I, I don't... I can't talk. I can't think about things. I don't want to think about anything. Okay? Okay. Okay. <clears throat> you just relax for a while, okay? Yeah. Just rest. Hey. Stay with me. Guiding Light, 